I was uh, involved in my PhD work in the Old Testament at University of Manchester, very prestigious and a very uh, rigorous academic atmosphere. And the Lord then dealt with me to come to IWS. And I couldn't understand why the Lord was pulling me out of a PhD, my dream, uh, my scholarship in the Old Testament. But I did what God wanted me to do. And one of the things that I have found at IWS in working in the rigor of the British system at University of Manchester, the rigor here at times has been more challenging, uh, more uh, academic than, uh, than I even began to realize. But I've been very thankful for that. Uh, I needed that for myself. Um, but also the professors here have been so encouraging. Uh, they teach with such humility, but they come from such uh, profound academic uh, experiences. Uh, but you know that you can sit down with them and they're going to help you and uh, get you through. And one of the things I found from you to the professors, uh, they want you to finish. They want you to uh, get across uh, the finish line. IWS, I told somebody, I'd heard it before what Robert Weber had said, but I can tell you that he brought me to IWS to mess me up. And uh, uh, it, God has used IWS and all of the courses. It's been a course, it's been a real journey for me. Uh, it has changed my life. It has deepened me in my Christian life. I just crossed the 45th year in ministry and it's like I'm just beginning to learn about grace. And uh, it's just been beautiful. The chapels here, every time God has spoken something into my heart. And the beautiful thing is everything I've done, every paper I've done, has flowed right back into our church. And I think of, especially on to the baptism that I did in 704, uh, I watched in that, that course, at the end of the course, we had people renewing their baptism and I saw people move that I've never seen moved before. It's 25, 20 to 30 people in that class. And now as I'm coming to the finish line and I'm writing my thesis on lament, I have been amazed at how much in my counseling and in our church atmosphere, it's just poured out of me as people have gone through ALS, uh, loss of loved ones, a loss through suicide. It's, it's been a life-changing experience, and I'm thankful to God and IWS.